Tis the season for giving. The Salvation Army has been a fixture for giving back during the holidays through the Angel Tree, the Red Kettle, and their Adopt-A-Family program. And joining us today is Major Anthony Barnes of the Salvation Army with more on how we can give back. And Salvation Army does such a great job in leading the charge during the holiday season. Thanks for being with us this morning. Thanks for having me on. Yes, how's everything going? How are you feeling through the holidays? I'm living the dream. I <laughs> love the holidays. This is a great time. Oh, that's great. Okay, so the Salvation Army does so much this time of the year. Tell us about the amount of support that you guys get to be able to do all of this? Well, it's what a privilege to serve the community, and we get to do exactly that. We are serving our neighbors in need, making sure they have everything that they need for this holiday season. We're awesome. having a blast. And most of us see you guys as we're out shopping during the holidays. You're outside of stores. Tell us about the Red Kettle Program. The Red Kettle Program, which is iconic, been around since 1891. Mm -hmm. uh, we bring in money that helps us throughout the year to serve families that are in the margins. When we think about that term, doing the most good, that's exactly what we're doing with the money that comes in each season. Yeah, give yeah. us a little bit more specifics because I think a lot of people pass that or, or many things throughout the season. They want to yeah. help, but I think it helps when you know exactly, like, when I donate this money, fill in the blank happens. Absolutely. So it's not just going to Christmas or gifts for the family, although we do that as well. We're talking rental assistance, wow. uh, homelessness prevention, keeping the lights on, keeping on the gas, making sure that every need, individualized need for an individual or family has been met. We are meeting those needs without discrimination. That's awesome. I also think it's so great, right? Everybody's busy. You guys make it so easy as you're going in or out of the store, make a donation and help all of the beautiful efforts you guys are doing. Yeah, when people put uh, a dollar or some change in that kettle, what they're doing is partnering with us to serve the community in the ways that are needed most, making sure that we are restoring hope and transforming lives for those people who maybe felt like things that hope was going away, mm. but now it's been restored. That's amazing. And we're all working together to do that. Another favorite program is the Angel Tree program. Tell me more about that one. So it's an opportunity for individuals, families, or community members to, to provide a toy or toys for the kids. We want to make sure that they have those gifts under the tree. You know, this, this time of year, kids are just excited, and we want to make sure that families are able to bridge the gap. We help them do that. And one really great thing is when, when people bring in toys for us to give to families, we don't need the credit. We don't take the credit. All the kids know is that somehow mom and dad are caregiver. They were able to get the toys under the tree oh, once again. Oh, wow. That and makes that's all it that even it more special. Us. You guys, right, aren't even doing this to... No up your brand. Okay, let's talk about the Adopt-A-Family program, another yes. amazing one. So it's an opportunity for an individual or a family or a community, uh, a business to adopt a family to say, I want to take care of this family specifically. Give me the wish list. And so we do. We give them that wish list and people go out and get all the gifts and they bring them in and then we provide that to the family. Wow. There's so yeah. much amazing things about the season, but I do think watching people give and that spirit of wanting to give and help others mm -hmm. is so beautiful. It is. It is. And, and really when, when that happens, they partner with us to do what we call Love Beyond. That's our theme this year. Mm -hmm. We want to love beyond just Christmas. It's not just a standard deal. We're looking at the individualized needs of an individual or family and saying, we want to serve you in the way that you need. Not the way that we think you need, yeah. but in the way that you need. And recognizing people as people, and yes, that they yeah. have different needs and wants. So this is amazing. How can people get more information on all of these programs? Because I'm sure they want to help. Well, I would just direct people to SalvationArmyUSA.org. They go to our website. They can find out everything they need about the Salvation Army in their community. I want to encourage people to give, whether it's at the Kettle or on that website. They can donate right there. But knowing that those resources go to helping people in need. Those are our neighbors. They live right next door to us. We eat next to them every day. We want to make sure that they are able to bridge the gap. Oh, that giving is so beautiful. Okay, do you have anything you want from Santa though, Major Barnes? You're doing all the giving. Me personally? Yeah. You know what? I just want more opportunities to give. I have Aww. everything that I need, but I want to make sure that the people that are in need, that we get to meet their needs this year. That is really beautiful. Well, thank you so much for being with us during thank this holiday you. season. Guys, there is a crisis.